Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and it is Saturday, so it's grocery haul day. And I have a massive, massive, over $600 grocery haul for you, including Costco where we did a major stock up, my local Kroger store, Sprouts, I've got a lot of good stuff in store. So if you're excited, give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not, turn your bell on because I do a grocery haul every Saturday in five videos every single week. Down in the description box, you will find nutrition coaching, personalized macros and calories, highly recommend. This is how I have lost and maintained a 140 pound weight loss, as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching for accountability to ask questions or talk with me directly. Links and discounts to my favorite healthy things and my Facebook group, come join us, we'd love to have you, are all down in that description box. So let me turn you around and let's talk about this massive grocery haul. So first up is my massive stock up haul from Costco. We were out of quite a few staples, so I picked up all those staples and then some other really good stuff. There's a lot of really great deals right now. So let me show you what I picked up from Costco. First up, we needed some more gallon size Ziploc bags. I usually buy the combo pack, but I have so many of the sandwich and snack bags and quart size, I just always run out of the gallon. These are currently on coupon. So I think it was $13 and you get four boxes or 152 bags. And then I grab my Unstoppables. These are also currently on coupon. I always buy these when they're on coupon. I never pay full price. I just wait for them to come on sale. And this is the Downy Fresh Scent. I also wanted the Kirkland brand of the makeup wipes, but they didn't have them. I looked everywhere. So I ended up getting the Neutrogena ones. These are also currently on coupon. So if they weren't on coupon, I would have skipped it. I do really like the Kirkland ones the best, but this is kind of cool because you get a few different wipes and some of the travel. I picked up some tuna fish. This is going to be part of my meal plan. I talk about what I'm doing starting January 1st as far as my food food goes in my training and I need some tuna fish. It's such a great source of protein. And then I also picked up some more of my favorite butter. This is the Kirkland version of the Kerrygold butter. The Vital Proteins Collagen Peptides are on sale, which is a killer deal. So I actually bought two. I use collagen in my coffee every single morning and it lasts forever. So I was so happy to see these on coupon. Also, Happy to see this. I didn't know Costco carried Alani protein shakes. I about died. I almost bought two cases, but I just ordered some more winter mint from Costco or from Walmart and I ordered another premier shake that's new. I can't find it anywhere but Walmart. Stay tuned. I'll be sharing it with you guys. So I just ordered protein shakes. So I limited myself to one case, but I really like the Alani's munchies. It's 140 calories, 20 grams of protein, and there's no carrageenan. So if you're sensitive or you avoid carrageenan, Alani is a great option. $15 for a 12 pack, that is an amazing deal. And then my favorite yogurt is also on coupon. This is a 16 pack and it was $8. That's like 50 cents a yogurt. That's an amazing deal. And the Chobani Zero Sugar is my all-time favorite. And then I got TurboTax for home and business. I do my own taxes every single year as I am self-employed. And then this allows us to do our home taxes as well. The main reason I went to Costco besides needing some staples is this is on coupon. So if you use TurboTax, this is the time to pick it up. And then I grabbed some more of the Snack Factory pretzels. I love these. These are my go-to pretzels. I love pretzels and peanut butter, pretzels and cheese. I love these as a snack before I work out. It's a really great fast acting carb or even after my workout, I like to pair it with either a protein or a fat for a really good snack. And these were only $8.99, super good deal. And then we are almost out of Q-tips. So I grabbed these. These are on coupon right now for $6.79. I feel like that's the price of one of these at the store. So I was excited they were on coupon. And then I mentioned in my grocery haul last week how expensive foil, saran wrap, parchment paper, is and I decided to get it at Costco. You get two huge packs of parchment paper for $12. So much better price. I didn't need saran wrap or foil, but I will be buying them at Costco. It's much more affordable. And then I got the two packs of the regular pepperoni for Troy. We go through a lot of pepperoni. He likes it with crackers and cheese. We make homemade pizzas. He puts it in a tortilla. If he eats a frozen pizza, he always doctors it up with a little more pepperoni and cheese. So this is a great deal. $10 for two packs. 
I will also be eating a lot of rolled oats and oatmeal <laughs> into the new year as part of my meal plan. And this is the Farmer's No Organic Sprouted Rolled Oats. So really the best of the best when it comes to rolled oats. And this was just over $10. That's an amazing, amazing deal. I can use this in baking. And of course, for having hot oatmeal and overnight oats. Listerine is also on coupon. This is our go-to mouthwash. It's my favorite. So I picked that up. And then also on coupon is peanut butter. This is Troy's favorite peanut butter. $7 and 60 cents I think for two which like I said is the price of one at the grocery store I also got some Tillamook medium cheddar cheese slices we just like having sliced cheese on hand we are a cheese family we eat a lot of cheese so I picked that up I want to say this was $10.99 and then I opted for this bread for Troy it's so soft this is the Sara Lee Artes Artesno Artesano Artisano. How do you pronounce that? Our, we're going to call it Artisano. It was $5 for two loaves. I throw one in the freezer and then we put one in our bread box. So I picked that up. And then of course, one of the other main reasons I ran to Costco was for paper towels and also Gatorade Zero. I bought two cases. They're on sale for $14.50 a case, which is a killer deal. Those are already in the garage. And then I bought my paper towels. I was pretty excited to see this. I'm going to start topping my yogurt bowl with this. I'm almost out of granola. This is a better option if you want protein. Protein. So it has 11 grams of protein and nine grams of fiber per serving. This is the cinnamon toast Catalina crunch. It's 110 calories for a third of a cup. I usually do about a quarter cup. So I'll still get what, four or five grams of protein. So not bad at all. And also this has nine grams of fiber. So just a better option for protein and fiber on your yogurt. And this was only $10.99. No surprise, I grabbed another two pack of Troy's four bean salad. This is his favorite salad. And then I got the little bag of mini potatoes. I pay $4 for a teeny tiny bag at my Kroger store. This was $4.50 for five pounds. And we use these in our pot roast. I eat a lot of potatoes. They're also on my meal plan moving forward. So we'll definitely use those up. And then another staple for us is the fully cooked bacon. This just makes life so easy. I cook a whole section of these up at once in my microwave and then we have bacon ready to go. Troy uses this for breakfast sandwiches. We like to make the Felicia combo bowls with bacon. This is only $12.99 for about 50 slices. That's a really great deal. And then I did get some dog treats. They had these superfood sticks, salmon and mango. These are human grade dog treats. So really good ingredients. Same with these sweet potato chews. All that's in there is sweet potato. So nice, clean dog treat. And then I did pick up a pack of ketchup, a two pack of the organic ketchup from Heinz. Troy uses a lot of ketchup and I'd rather he have the organic one. It's just a better option. And then I did grab some pears. Pears just spoke to me. They sounded really good. They're really hard. So I'm hoping they ripen quickly because they just sound super good for a fruit for the week. So that is everything that I picked up at Costco. Let's go ahead and jump into the rest of the grocery haul. So the rest of my grocery haul for the week is from both Sprouts and my local Kroger store, which in our area is called Fries. I found some amazing, amazing deals. So let's jump in. So first let's start with Sprouts. That's the smallest haul. I mainly went there for produce and then I always like to check their meat section and see if there's any great reduced meat deals. This is a great deal. This is from the brand Pasture Bird. This is pasture raised chicken tenderloins. They were on sale for $4.74. So that is a fantastic deal. And then I also found 8515 grass fed grass finished organic ground beef for $5.52 a pound. That is such a great deal. As you know, with reduced meat, I either cook it right away or throw it in my freezer. I also picked up a couple more of my favorite electrolyte waters. I like to have these after I work out or even during or before I work out. So this is the brand Roar and I got a strawberry lemonade and the cucumber watermelon. That's actually my favorite flavor. Like I said, I mainly went there for produce. So I got this fruit tray. It was on sale for $4. Cantaloupe, honeydew melon, pineapple, and grape. And then I got this big pack of mushrooms. I actually need mushrooms for a couple of recipes this next week. I also needed one yellow onion, one large zucchini or a couple small. She's a big zucchini, so I only got one. I also needed a couple of oranges for my meal prep, some asparagus for my meal prep, some green onions, and then some fresh herbs. I needed basil and I needed oregano. These are for recipes. And then lastly, just a couple of bananas. Now moving in to Kroger, starting off with two gallons of 1% milk for Troy. He goes through a couple gallons of milk every week. I also picked up the Pizzeria Style Blend 
cheese. It's a mix of low moisture part skin mozzarella and smoky provolone. This is so good. This is better just than regular mozzarella cheese for pizzas and things. So I picked that up. And then over in the reduced bakery for Troy, I got these little mini cherry strudels and some apple strudels. These were like $1.25 a pack. They're perfect. I can even, I eat them as well because they're really small. So it's the perfect pre-portioned out sweet treat. I also got my favorite hash browns, Simply Potatoes. I can have hash browns pretty regularly on my meal plan for my cut. So I picked up the Simply Hash Browns. They are my favorite. And this time I got the Southwest style. I thought, why not? Why not throw in a little veggie with my potatoes? And then I did pick up a couple salad kits. I've been loving the real good chicken nuggets on salad. So these were three for 11. So I grabbed two. I have an apple pear or an apple feta kit. This is spinach and spring mix with feta, honey sweetened almonds and cinnamon puffed apples with a white balsamic shallot vinaigrette. That sounds incredible. And then I also got the Caesar with bacon chopped salad kit. Caesar is Troy's favorite. So I figure if he didn't want this one, he could do this one. And that's a quick, easy lunch or dinner. I also needed pesto for a recipe. I like having pesto on hand, even though it's high calorie, high point, high fat, a little bit goes a long way. So it just adds some really good flavor. It's super good on sandwiches in place of other condiments. Really, really good. And then I saw these in the refrigerated section. They have tags on them, so it's kind of hard to read, but these are the light and fit zero sugar little yogurt shakes. 40 calories, eight grams of protein. Holy moly, that's incredible. I'm actually going to have one of these after I finish filming this grocery haul and they were on sale for 95 cents a piece. There was three on sale, so I bought all three. I also picked up some heavy whipping cream. I like to make my old my own cold foam for my cold brew coffee. I do one tablespoon of heavy whipping cream and it's perfect for that cold foam. And I also notice when I have that in my coffee, it keeps me a little bit more full. So I'm not mad about that, so I picked that up. And then I saw the these at checkout and I do like the body armor lights and again these go hand in hand with working out similar to my roar water these are the body armor zero sugar so I got an orange and a lemon lime they were two for three dollars and I thought that I would just try them out see if I like them and then Troy has wanted to cut back on diet coke not eliminate it completely but cut back so I picked up some tea for him he thought he could try having tea in place of Diet Coke. So this is the Gold Peak Slightly Sweet Tea. And then I also found the Kroger brand of the Zero Sugar Blackberry. So I thought that he could try those two out, see what he thinks. If you have a favorite iced tea, pre-made iced tea, let me know down in the comments. I also picked up some paper plates because convenient and I had a coupon and then I found this pie plate in the clearance section of Christmas. It was $1.50. It was $1.50 for this super nice pie plate. I have a large one, but I've always wanted just a smaller pie plate. Couldn't pass up that deal. Also grabbed one more of my good culture cottage cheese. I've been loving cottage cheese. As you know, it's such a great source of protein. So I wanted to make sure I had enough for the week. And then I found these in the reduced bakery section for $1.94. That is a great deal. These are the Joseph's pitas. I'm going to throw them in the freezer. And then that way, when I want one for sandwiches, wraps, all I have to do is pull it out, defrost it, and that way they will last. That, again, such a great deal. And in the meat section, I always stop by the meat section to see what's reduced. They have their 97, 3% ground chicken for $3.47. That's my favorite. I love ground chicken and I would have got more if they had more reduced, but they only had the two pounds. So I picked those up. And then I also grabbed one more pound of the 99% ground turkey, also $3.77. And then strawberries were $1.99 a pack. That's an incredible deal. So I picked up two of those for fruits for the week in addition to the pears that I bought at Costco. And then their little pomegranate seeds were on clearance for $1.80. I thought I could top my yogurt bowl with these or oatmeal. Pomegranate seeds are really, really good for you, especially if you're perimenopause or in menopause. So I thought that for $1.80, I couldn't pass it up. I also needed some more lime juice, so I picked that up. And last but not least, I did find this little veggie tray. We got one of these before and we ate it all within a couple days. This has broccoli, carrots, and cauliflower in it, $1.96 reduced. So I thought we could have veggies and dip today as well. And then I did pick up a 24 pack 
of Diet Coke for Troy. So that finishes out this massive grocery haul, Kroger store and Sprouts. Let's jump into what's for dinner and what you'll see in meal prep. Here's what is on my menu for the week. So today, Saturday, we always go out for dinner. Tomorrow, Sunday, I am making turkey meatballs. We'll probably pair that with rice or potatoes. Monday, I'm actually doing an orange chicken stir fry. You'll see that recipe in Wednesdays, what I eat in a day. Tuesday's leftovers. Wednesday, we're going to do a burger night. And then Thursday and Friday, we do leftovers as well. That way we're able to finish up everything from earlier in the week. And then here is what you'll be seeing in Monday's meal prep. Cannot wait. All of these recipes align nicely with my current cut. So for breakfast, I am doing a baked cranberry oatmeal. I may add protein to this. I'm debating on that, but I'm definitely doing this cranberry oatmeal. For lunch, we're going to do ground turkey and mushroom soup. I don't know, that just sounds really, really good. And then for a snack, I'm making a protein berry crumble, kind of like a cobbler, but with protein. So stay tuned for all three recipes on Monday. Thank you for joining me for this week's massive haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing everything I picked up from Costco, Kroger, and Sprouts. We found some amazing deals. There's actually some fantastic Costco deals going on right now and Sam's Club. So if you have a Sam's Club in your area, I've heard that they're having equally as good of sales. So definitely check them out. And if you enjoyed the grocery haul, give it a thumbs up. Again, subscribe, turn your bell on so you never miss a future video. Don't forget to check out the description box for nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my favorite things. And of course, come join our Facebook group. We'd love to have you. Happy Saturday, friends, and I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Bye.